Hi everybody, so in this video I'm going to show you how to lock your note because some of us like taking note we might take note of our information for example our bank account so that we need to have the user and password so that when we take note we are, we are afraid that somebody might check and take out the information that we have noted in our notes However, today I'm going to show you how to lock any notes that you want to lock. Okay, so let's get started. First of all, just launch your note. So this is my note. Okay, I have noted many information. I have noted blockers, so I noted about my block, so I have something to read later. Okay, and I have emails, so I have different notes family some information about my family and also Joe scholarship I have scholarships information I have story screen note teaching out vocabulary from everywhere YouTube okay so most of all love taking note before we get started I would like to explain you some functions inside the note so as can be seen you see new folder so this is where you can create a new folder for example testing save where is it over here testing okay testing so this is testing so just go to testing so let me just type in the note I uh, just for example I know one website which is very important can be uh, apple.com maybe just an example or I know down about my bank account you can take note like this is my bank account just and password I know like seven eight one two three gh for example so this is my bank account website that I don't want everybody to see. I don't want anyone to come and check it or steal the information from me. Or it can be my new uh, Gmail because I have different accounts maybe. I have lots of uh, email accounts. So I can take like, yeah, for example, at Gmail I have a different mail. Gmail I have at live.com I have uh, at iCloud.com and also have uh, Yahoo.com the thing is different email I use different password so in here I can take note like this example it's just an example so I have different password for different email or it can be my Facebook account so I have Facebook the thing is that which one which email that I use for my Facebook so I also need to take that note right because it's important our brain cannot remember every information and also the password for pa Facebook is different now the password right Okay, so now I have testing, I have the note, testing. Okay, uh, have a testing note here. But the thing is that when my friends come and ask me or borrow my phone, then they might go to that folder, that notes. So they might find, oh, bank account, something like that. So they might mess up with my information. They can edit, they can adjust anything that they want. Maybe they delete one uh, digit, password digit, so that I might not remember in the future. So the thing is that you need to know how to lock, so that no one can check it. So in order to lock that information, is just go to this sign, lock note. And then you will be asked to create the password for all your lock notes. So to make it. Just an example, one, two, three, four, five. 
require one two three four five hint for example if you forget the your password so you can give yourself a hint so the hint is one two five this is my hint that's it lock at that it's not end yet what you need to do is here as you can see the lock so you can click on this this sign you see the lock up there you can click on the lock sign here now this node is locked okay see uh, the icon here so you know this locked so when your friend go and check no this node is already locked you note so you will be asked to enter the, the password for example I put only one two four okay, okay. no try again five yep and if you want to unlock your note oh sorry you have two ways in order to lock your note after adding the lock on your note you will see this sign or you can go back and you click on this one note lock now Just click lock it's locked okay so now it's locked no more yep so if anyone want to want to view this note they need to know your password so yeah that that's it and if you want to remove that note remove just click on this again and then you see the word remove lock lock removed that's it no more lock okay in case you forget your password what should you do okay so in case you want to change your password at the moment for example lock edit so I click one more time this note is locked just in case I want to change my password what should I do we have to change it just go back to settings and notes you see password here change password so old password at the moment one two three four five new password so I can put six seven eight nine zero uh, verify which means you have to uh, type it again six seven eight nine zero hint six two zero okay done let's see if my lock is changed so this node is locked so let's type in with my new password six seven eight nine zero okay so now I can change my password okay so Another way to lock your password is with your Touch ID. Okay, so now let me lock and unlock with the Touch ID. So use password, use Touch ID. Just turn it on. Enter the password for your lock note six seven eight zero. Okay, so now Touch ID is on. Let's see okay so this node is locked you note okay so you have two choices either you want to enter the password or touch ID for notes so I put my thumb right now that's it I don't have to type in the password right okay lock again and let's see it again what happens yep that's it I don't have to type in the password okay so just in case you forgot your password what should you do this note is locked and you forgot your password of your note well what you need to do is go to setting again password yeah note sorry go to notes password and reset password in here enter the password for your iCloud account so you need to enter your iCloud account in order to reset it so this is my iCloud account let's see what happened 
Just click OK. Yeah. Reset password. Now you have another chance to retype or to give your note a new password. So again, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Hint, one, two, five. Use Touch ID. So for my suggestion, it is better to use Touch ID. Just turn it on uh, from the beginning so that it's much easier when you forget the password later. You don't have to do the reset or you don't have to enter the password. Just put your thumb on your Touch ID and then the note is locked or unlocked. Okay, so just click done. That's it. Go back to the note. Use the note and the password. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Oh, that is not the correct password for this note. Try a different password. Hint six two zero. Oh, really? Here. Updated password. This node is use is using an old password. Would you like to update all the nodes using this password to use your current password? Update. Because I have already changed the new password, right? Let's see. What is my new password? One, two, three, four, five. That's it. So this is the new password. So new password is updated for all nodes. Once again, you don't have to uh Enter the password if you have already turned on the touch ID from the beginning. So you the note, scan. That's it. That's it, everybody. If you have any questions, just let me know with the comment down below, and don't forget to share with your friend. And also, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.